Okay, so today we are drawing a bottom half to a monster. And this actually would uh, line up with um, the top half if you wanted to put the two pieces together. So that makes a nice long fun um, drawing or painting. So um, our artist for inspiration is Chris Uphughes because he does a lot of cute faces and cute cartoon art. And um, he's actually a contemporary artist, meaning that he is living and working as an artist still today. And a story for inspiration would be, Hey, That's My Monster. And so we're going to get started here um, at the top with a rectangle for the top part of the body. Well, the top as it is on this page. We're actually doing all the bottom half of the body. Um, so then we're going to come out on each side. And this could be shorts or it could be a skirt. So if you wanted to make it um, a skirt, you just connect it all the way across. If you want to switch it up to shorts, you could just make triangle shape here. Then we're going to come down for the legs. And as usual, you would draw with pencil first. I'm drawing with the Sharpie because it shows up on the video. Pencil does not show up well. All right, and I'm gonna go across here for the socks and just wave in and out. And then I'm gonna do the sneakers. out on each side down a little bit and then just bump and connect down bump and connect down and then there's a little sole or heel there um, connect this across and then I made a little star with a circle on it. For the sneaker design. And then the laces. And some lines here. And then there are some lines down here. And some lines on the legs too. And it was good to get some line drawing practice, so it's maybe a zigzag here on the shirt. And maybe some straight lines in here for some stripes on the shorts or on the skirt, whichever you decided to do. All right, so good luck with yours. Um, I outlined this one with crayons afterward, and then I painted it with watercolor paints. So I just used, you know, regular um, Crayola crayons for tracing over my lines. You would definitely want to do that with your to cover up your pencil lines okay pressing nice and hard and then even on my stripes and then the paints that i used um good ones to use are crayola
and then um, with the brush and then just carefully painting in the spaces one at a time or again if all you have is uh, markers and crayons then you can fill it in with that it will still be really cute so I hope you enjoy um, making this and I will see you next time. Happy summer.